I'm Mario from Gojira. I'm the drummer of the band, and we play today in a Bloodstock Festival. So um, usually, when we work on a cover of the album, it's um, usually my brother is drawing because he's very talented to draw, and he have a lot of ideas. Um, but since a couple of years, we start to work together because I. Uh, I'm also painting, I'm also drawing, making pictures. I, I do a lot of uh, a lot of things for Gojira on the artistical point of view, you know. I'm painting since I'm a child, but um, it's a very, very simple process. Just um, I just try to relax and let things go out of me. I don't have any pretentious, any uh, technical issues you know I, I don't care about technique you know I just need to express something it's uh, for me something very very important and uh, it comes from the heart from from the pain from the joy all kind of emotion I express everything I can you know and um, now I start a new thing I paint on my drum heads after playing you know instead of putting in a trash I do some drawings and now I have a website <laughs> And uh, I put all the drum heads and people can buy if they want, so... And it works very well, actually. I think both aspects are very important. The music, uh, without the visual, there is something missing, you know. So for us, it's uh, the message, the visual, the music. It's all together something very important. And uh, we need to be on the road for something. So we have a message, we have uh, something to fight for. And I think the visual is a part of the whole process, you know? Yeah. For example, on the Facebook, we try to put only picture, uh, we're talking about poetry, you know? We love symbolism. We don't like to put like picture like this, you know? We always try to put something mystical. We love mystery, mystery of life. We don't like when it's too much precise, you know, like uh, too much details too many details we don't like details we love when it's mysterious you know sometimes I'm thinking mm, I'm on earth and uh, it's very difficult <laughs> and there is a lot of mystery so I try to express this kind of feeling in my art you know even in the photography I love white and black and I, I love when it's between two worlds you know um, it's a lot of subconscious things you know uh, my fears my, everything you know I have inside and uh, I just try to translate with painting or photography sometimes uh, I draw something but I, I don't know what I'm going to draw you know it's uh, and one second after I, I'm doing something and it's very interesting sometimes I watch you know what I'm painting and oh that's curious that's uh, very interesting you know? we are going to try to go deeper and deeper in the music and in the visual and in a, on stage also, we, we have a lot of ambition. We want to create something amazing, you know, like a big screen with a, a lot of image, a lot of mystical image. We want to play with light. We want to do a great show, uh, trying to find some new ideas on the musical point of view. So uh, always try to uh, find some riff on the road. We have a, uh, like uh, people around us, like my sister, is, she's an amazing photographer, one of my biggest influence in white and black, very blurry, very mystical. It's a wonderful work. And she do a lot, a lot of picture for us, also for the live and also for uh, just picture of the band. We also have a, a woman, his name is Anne de Gaini. She do a lot of video clip. She did the L'Enfant Sauvage video clip and she do a lot of uh, videos for the live. I do the teaser of the band. I do the photography and uh, my brother is drawing always, you know. So it's uh, like a family, you know, uh, thing.